I can remember calling the cells on the 1000 index in our last two to three videos. You guys can still go check out the video. So I'm currently on a sell trade on the 1000 index. I've been on this sell trade for some time now. I've been holding these cells since yesterday and I'm still expecting more cells. I share this sell signal basically to my VIP members. We've been on winning streak throughout this week, back to back wins. So more sales is expected on the 1000 index. So basically, what's my market analysis? How did I know this index is going to sell from this zone? And in the last video on the 1000 index, which I took a short term buy trade, and I told you guys that I'm bearish on this index, regardless of buying at that point in time, I was bearish on the 1000 index. And I told you guys that for price to create this triple top formation, the first high is here. The second highs are this zone, second highs are this zone, and the third high is here. This is a bearish formation. Price creating this triple top indicates that we are likely to get a massive decline in value on this index. So, what's the market analysis basically? Coming to the weekly time frame, as you guys know, that whenever you want to analyze the market, whenever you want to look out for trade opportunities, I start from a high time frame, and this high time frame can be the weekly time frame, it can be the monthly time frame. And it can be the daily time frame so in most cases i analyze starting from the weekly time frame so on this time frame on the 1000 index you can see that this index is currently on a strong level of resistance a historical level which we've got um historical moves basically you can see price reacting on this level previously let's check when this move happened it happened on the 2nd of august 2020 to 2021 sorry 22nd of august 2021 and another move repeated here another approach of this zone happened here on 31st of october 2021 then on 27th of february 2022 we also got a market reaction from this zone price selling on the approach of this level so for price to create this zone which we've got multiple sell moves from there's a possibility of same price come back to the same level to still sell from it Creating this zone alone signifies something. It indicates that we have sellers interested on this index at this zone. So if the market can create this level, there's a possibility of same price come back to this zone to sell from it to give the sell reactions from it. So I was able to identify this zone, identify the market formation on the daily time frame. Same price creates a triple top formation, and triple tops are very reversal pattern formation. And looking at the previous moves on this index. It's clear that this index has been on a massive increase in value. This index has been very, very bullish for some time now. So it's got to this historical level, which I was expecting this index to start selling from. And also understand that this index is in an overbought zone. The buyers seem not to be interested on buying this index again because it's been buying for a very long time. This level seems to be an expensive level, a high price value for the buyers to buy. So the sellers are likely to take charge of this market, pushing the market to the downside at least to this zone this is our next possible level our next level basically which i would be expecting price to sell to in the coming weeks and months so let's expect long bearish move on the 1000 index basically so after spotting the market structure the next thing is to spot our possible levels and zones so if price can react to this level if price would get to this zone and break below it the next level price would be facing would be this level Right, so when I identified this structure on the daily time frame, on the weekly time frame, sorry, I went to the time frame to spot a bearish formation which price presented a triple top formation. So I had to take advantage of this wonderful trade opportunity by spotting the market formation. Basically, you can see this first move which market was in an uptrend. So I identified every trend inside of this daily time frame structure. Remember, we are looking at for possible sell levels and sell opportunities. So we have to spot every zone and every market formation in order to identify a bearish formation to take our sell trade. So I got this um, market structure spotted, this uptrend here, the first uptrend, the second uptrend, and basically the third uptrend here, which price formed the last stop for the triple top formation. So you are getting the sales basically. So I had to identify a zone on a lower time frame, the forward time frame, inside of this formation generally. So I went to the forward time frame and spotted this structure and spotted this zone, which we can see price 
he reacting on a couple of times right you got price sell on this zone first reaction was a buy reaction price bought on this level as a support broke below it broke above it here support here again support 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 before the retest i think price tried retesting this zone but we didn't really get the perfect retest of this level but we've got market reactions previously on this zone so our next level basically is at this point which can also see price approach this zone giving the search from it right then market reactions here is support support here basically support here before this level got broken turned resistance so for me to identify this level spotting the market reactions on it i was expecting price to still react on this level because we can see what market did on this level he um, previously or historically you can see what market did on this level so i was basically expecting something similar on this same zone so we can see that we got this uptrend move which price got to this level and stood from here as a resistance before breaking above it giving the retest on it as a support price bought to the upside now market was inside of this uptrend structure market was inside of this uptrend formation which i knew that the breakout is likely to come up soon so on price getting to this zone we had this first breakout which the bulls pushed the market to the upside again to attract and to get the seller stopped out so they sold this market again the second time they managed to push the market the bears managed to push the market down to the second time came back to this zone to retest this level so it was at this point i got interested on selling this index after getting the first reaction i had the second reaction so i was expecting the third reaction which also gave something that looks like a triple top as well on this four time frame the first high is there the second high is at this zone sorry second high is at this zone and third high is at this point and when we go to the one hour time frame we can see this formation is a bearish formation because you can already see price create lower heights formation but we can see that clearly on the one hour time frame so on this one hour time frame we can see this market formation price creating the first highs here the second highs are this zone a lower high a lower high a lower high so this is our trend resistance level why this is our trend support level here basically because you can see market reactions previously on this level price buying from as a support right first reaction here second reaction at this zone first sell reaction here our change resistance level second reaction so after this trip after this formation here we got the first high this looks like a double top before this next high but we can also call it a triple top right because um these highs are in line almost in line until price created another top here which was lower so this lower top indicated that this structure is turning bear this is a very structure and the bears have actually come into the market to push this market to the downside so i caught this sell trade at this point i think at this zone basically i shared the sell signal here i asked my vip members to sell this index at this zone because this little sells before this retracement price came back to test this level because this looks like a head and shoulders pattern formation before the break of the neckline so this is like a retest of the neckline after selling this index at this zone we took partial profits moved our stop loss below our entry and trades moving nice well. so i also had another level identified to catch my second entry i took advantage of this trade setup on my conservative account i'll be dropping the account and trade screen record right here and this is my big account which is running over a thousand dollars in profit more sales expected on this index basically let's expect price to get to this level at least so that's how they take the sell trade on boom 1000 index by identifying the market structure or spotting my levels and zones and reading the market's mind over the years of trading synthetic indices i've come to understand that all this market respects most the king of this market is price action analysis being able to understand technical analysis properly you'll be able to read what could happen next you'll be able to read the market's mind predicting the next move on this index so our first tp level is likely to be here which i would set by the end of this video i've already updated my vip members i've asked them to take partial profits on this trade so i'll be setting our automatic tp level at this point more sales is expected looking at the structure on the daily time frame we'd we'll be expecting more sales at least we'd we'll see unbreachable sales to this point market moves that will not expect any buy move or buy retracement so let's watch out for this zone for price to get to this point so if price can get to this level we can as well take advantage of this trade for swing trade opportunities on the break of this zone the retest on it 
then we'll be getting more cells basically on this index that we test on it here then we'll be seeing this index sell more so my first general tp level on this index we are expecting price to get to is at this zone this double bottom formation neckline here that's what expecting price to get to because you can see that this double bottom formation is what produced this buy move we are getting at this point so that's it guys that was able to take the sell trade on the 1000 index by identifying the market structure spotting my levels and zones then going to the lower time frame for my entry points so hit the like button for more trades just like and drop a good comment on this video don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel and to my returning viewers i appreciate the support please engage in my videos chilling me a lot guys let's do more and have another day